Introduction to horse blogging. I have a cast on my arm and it came off because I was horse blogging. The percentage of emails that I get that contain death threats is alarmingly high for a horse blog. I don't trust God behind the wheel at this point. God had a little too much. Anonymous hacked my horse blog. Fucking anonymous. Don't you have like Hillary Clinton's emails to be exposing or some shit? Let's touch this and really just get it. I'm a very badly behaved mother. Do you see the moon rising over there? Look at this. Look at this shit. In case you can't see that full moon, Let's just go in a little bit. I have a gluten leg. I have a gluten leg. My first channel is glutenhor55, and that's with an underscore. Welcome to my YouTube channel. Basically, give me a fing reason not to s my own f off with a f that. F that f Dude, I'm feeling pretty randy, man. I'm gonna get home and write in my journal. Vin Diesel is not allowed near my dog or cat because I heard what he does. And I heard that Tim Allen and Vin Diesel fuck cats. I highly disagree. Vin Diesel is definitely coming over and that's final. And Vin Diesel is gonna do our landscaping. Vin Diesel's doing our whole yard for 5,000 and he's good too. How would you like to never be without a bathroom? Let's just say you always had a bathroom with you. I've been studying baby culture, and babies have a very, a bathroom bag is what I'm calling it. What's a fucking breath worth to me if I don't have a horse blog to my name? What's a fucking breath worth? The only time you can really be brave is when you're scared. Bravery is when you're scared and you're still doing what you believe in. The only time you can really demonstrate your commitment to anything is when you don't feel like it. And by the way, this all applies back to horse blogging. Fuck, dude. I have to be Steve Roganbuck. How many people in this park hear me yelling and change their direction so that they don't come near me?